My guest is John Dunn, whose uh, brand new title is General Manager with Iowa Realty. And John, it occurs to me that you're a busy guy because you're still helping with the management at both Valley West and Jordan Grove Iowa Realty offices. That's, that's a pretty busy dance card. Uh, that's correct, Mike. <laughs> and appreciate you the invite back to your show here. Um, yeah, it's, it's just uh, some more responsibility. Everybody's got a little room on their plate. So, uh, but I <laughs> look forward to the opportunity to uh, lead uh, Iowa Realty into the next generation. Well, we're in good hands, I'll guarantee you. Uh, a few weeks ago, we had a chat uh, about this extraordinary situation we're in. And uh, we want to refresh uh, that conversation a little bit here. Uh, and we've, we've been able to see some things happen since that chat in terms of sales. And it's been pretty good. It's been it's been really good um, considering the times that we're in right. unprecedented really. Uh, but you know, last time we spoke, it was they were a little bit more uncertain, and and there's been some more certainty to what's been going on, and uh, and so we've adapted that. We have uh, we are an essential business in real estate, right. um, and so that follows a lot of things from our closing to our lending. Uh, but really, the realtors are out there. The Des Moines Area Association of Realtors there uh, in, in the first quarter, we've had a 12.4% increase in sold homes, yeah. which is was just fantastic versus the first quarter of 2019. I like those statistics, but I think even a bigger stat in that is what really happened in March and, and sold data, as you know, Mike, um, that's kind of going to what happened in the past, but penned as we call them, or written contracts, were there any contracts written in March of this year and we've seen a, a nice increase there too, a 12.6% increase. So 1,524 homes went under contract in March, um, which is fantastic to have that going on. Well, and April's been rather busy too. Uh, and it speaks to the idea that buyers and sellers need to connect. Uh, people need to make that move. Uh, things change in, in people's lives, right? They certainly do, and we see it from uh, you know couples getting married to somebody who just takes the new position in Des Moines. Uh, families grow. Right. Uh, fam there's empty nesters out there. That happens too, and, and to everything from estate sales. So uh, change is really the catalyst for real estate, and uh, that's why you're seeing the numbers here. Well, let's talk safety because this this is what everybody's concerned about, and uh, we have pivoted into a, a stance that really has that as our priority in terms of taking care of of safety precautions, whether someone does an open house with us or uh, private showing. Uh, we have lots of flexibility, but safety is, is primary. It is number one. Um, and we have, we listen to our clients very well from a seller that, that uh, how we show and how we guide them to uh, have their lights turned on when there's a showing, for instance, they elect to show uh, to, to limit the touch points in the homes. And any of the agents are showing to, to have those wipes, the booties, the whole nine yards yeah. to kind of sanitize it. So the buyers are in this, the sellers are in this, we're all in this together, and it's, it's been a pretty good outcome. But I think people appreciate the fact that we're, we are safety conscious, and uh, they're patient, they're understanding, they get it. That's true. I mean, you know, iRealty has been here for 70 years. We have the highest level of professional agent. iRealty agents is trained, um, and this is some more training that's going on with this. But what they really look for is that trusted advisor and so you can look at our agents in their eyes and they, and they get that trust, um, whether you're, you're selling or buying, uh, and it's a fantastic a, a, a relationship that they- Talk bought. about some of the uh, new innovations. Uh, the dry, we did a feature on drive ups uh, closings the other day mm -hmm. at Midland. Uh, this, is, this is a great idea. It's, it's good. Uh, it's good to be us with uh, Midland Title and Escrow. Uh, the, we were the first broker to do that, and uh, it gives an option for the customer to <coughs> literally drive up in their car. We got yeah. a designated parking spot. You've seen the feature, but it is fantastic. It's a very safe environment. But for the clients that really want to go into it and sit down and close, um, we have designated uh, closing uh, uh, conference rooms in each office. Sure. It's all sanitized. And so that works really well for either way. Agents are doing uh, uh, visual tours, uh, Facebook connections, uh, doing all kinds of things with social media uh, to, to accommodate people depending on what their comfort level is, right? Yeah, and it works. The, the virtual tour, the live tours we do on Sundays, and we've even done some lunches during the week. Um, it, it features the house, uh, so sellers are liking that. And then we're getting a lot of connection on social media and then follow up showings from that and keeping the economy going. So it's another way to use technology to connect buyers and sellers. And our new app and the Iowa Realty website, comprehensive website, are great tools for people, whether or not we're in a situation like the one we're in now. 
It is, and I think sometimes uh, that's a good place to start if you're looking at the home buying process because you can search on there and then we, we, we have what we call an internet data exchange and so all the listings are on Iowa Realty's website. So, mm -hmm. and we are on our competitor's website too. So that's a nice way that we cooperate. So one, one, one place does it all. And then our mobile app, you can download that, go to the app store, right. download that. And uh, during the weekends, we see a lot of people are out using that. Uh, it's, it's fully functional. Uh, really a nice tool to get well, you started. Bottom line is we're on top of it. Uh, we're, we're flexible and we're innovative and we've got your back as we have had for 70 years, past, present and future prospects and, and uh, customers of Iowa Really, We'd like to hear from you about your experience with Iowa Really. Tell us about it at hashtag Iowa Really, and thanks to John Dunn. Congratulations again and uh, come back and see us. Will do, Mike. You bet. Coming up, Aaron Moon will be here with Iowa Really to talk about Iowa's largest builder, Hubble Homes in Waukee. The business record has awarded Iowa Realty with their number one rating among all Metro residential real estate companies for 2019. Glen Village in Waukee, next stop on the home show and Aaron Moon from Hubble Homes in Iowa really is here. Good to see you. Good to see you, Mike. Uh, you know, we were talking before going on camera about Hubble, uh, the unique builder that they are. Number one, they're the largest in Iowa. Uh, 160 year reputation, all the rest if we have viewers who aren't familiar. But they're not just the builder of your house. In so many cases, they are the creator, more or less, of your neighborhood. And yeah. Glen Village is a great example. They really are, yep. Uh, Glen Village is just really a unique community. Uh, it's really the only one in the metro of its kind. Um, you, know, you have a couple pools, you have the uh, bike and walking trails, the play areas, and it's a conservation community, right. uh, which is really important as and well. a beautiful clubhouse that's part of the package. Yeah, it's, it's certainly unique, and the location. Uh, the park is close and walkable for almost everybody. The uh, uh, schools for the most part mm -hmm. are walkable. Mm -hmm. So it's just an ideal spot there in the heart of Waukee. Uh, and that's uh, where the property values just don't get any better. Waukee, Iowa nowadays, the schools are being requested. It's, a, it's just a great place to live. It is, it really is. Well, let's have a look here. We have six homes, as I understand it, ready to go out there. We sure do, yep, yep. Uh, what we're looking at here is uh, Hubble Homes Forester Plan. We actually have two of those out here. Uh, we're checking out this one on Bailey Circle. Um, about 2,500 uh, square feet to finish on this one. Um, great products from GE, uh, Kitra Lighting, um, Kohler as well, um, engineered hardwood floors from Shaw. Uh, just a great plan. Uh, two bedrooms up, one bedroom down, a great sunroom, uh, plenty of storage throughout the home. Some of the things that we'll let the video play here, some of the things that uh, Hubble does that not every builder is going to do for you, an amazing in-house warranty program, that dry basement guarantee, Aaron, right. uh, pretty special. Couple of design studios, could save you some yes. time, maybe some money. That's right. Yeah. Now, as I understand it, this is uh, this three-bedroom ranch has a sister that's very similar, a little more contemporary flavor. Correct, yeah. So uh, Stacy at our design studio uh, took over on both these as far as the design goes and just knocked it out of the park. Um, yeah. This particular one has a little more traditional exterior, um, traditional finishes on the inside, still looks absolutely amazing. Uh, full tile shower, uh, upgraded Kohler uh, shower bar system there. So uh, our other one, uh, which is over on Pembroke, is a little more contemporary exterior, um, has a really cool two-tone uh, cabinets in the kitchen, um, just some great flair throughout the house. What are the price points here then? Uh, on this particular home, you're at 394. Okay. And the uh, the other one is at 374. And then four other homes that are ready to go, in addition to a few home sites. But we are sort of nearing the end of uh, the neighborhood. It's been about a decade, hasn't it? Yeah. So we're in uh, we're in Plat 10, which is a final plat. Yep. So there's walkout, daylight, and standard home sites available. Terrific. If you just joined us, we're talking about Glen Village in Waukee, uh, planned community from Hubble Homes with the conservation element and all the rest. Should mention, Aaron, uh, Home Services Lending, taking care of closing costs uh, for all Hubble properties, preferred lender nowadays. Six homes ready to go from 374. What's the top end of the range out uh, there? 647. That's got to be a awesome special. Awesome Dawson plan. <laughs> I bet, yeah. And uh, every Saturday and Sunday, open house, all of the uh, Hubble properties around the metro. 
and safety precautions, Aaron, I'm sure all in place. Right? Yeah, yep. So booties, uh, hand sanitizer, rubber gloves. Great. We're wiping everything down uh, after a guest uh, sleeves. So. We'll send them out. Thanks for coming by. Thank you, Mike. Appreciate, Appreciate it. it. Want to mention Home Services Insurance, independent agency, uh, part of a national network, part of the Iowa Realty team, and that's Home Services Insurance. And coming up, great Iowa home feature for this week. Rick Brotrude will be here from Iowa Realty. Stay with us. Selling a home can be intimidating. That's why it's best to call in reinforcements. At Iowa Realty, our extensive team provides comparative market analysis, lending services for interested buyers. You guys are gonna love this place. And the expertise to handle anything out of left field. Easy there, Rocket. So you can sell your home faster, celebrate sooner. Even in these unprecedented times, Iowa Realty remains your trusted partner for buying and selling a home. Start your sale at iowarealty.com. Decorating for your loft or any space offers you more freedom than ever before. At The Elements, our design team can help you inject just the right amount of attitude so you're on a budget. Break out your fun, funky ideas. We think you'll like the price and the quality. Maybe all you need are some cool throw pillows and a great piece of art. Ask about our risk-free house call service. Visit ElementsByKSorby.com in Storm Lake and in the District at Prairie Trail in Ankeny. We're anything but ordinary. This fabulous story and a half sits in beautiful Augustine in the uh, city of Johnston, Iowa, absolutely loaded with luxury. And Rick uh, Brotrude is here to talk about this great Iowa home. Rick, it's nice to see you. Good morning. Uh, you know, Johnston is famous for beautiful homes, lots of them. Uh, yes, uh, there's a lot of billion dollar homes in Johnston. Boy, and, that's uh, for sure. Uh, and when we, we're gonna tease them a little about the price here, but this home is just loaded. Yeah, it was custom built back in 2005 and uh, you know, four ensuite bathrooms and over 5,600 feet and just a lot, a lot of extras in it on a wooded lot. Two thirds of an acre with trees, uh, that home site alone would be uh, uh, flirting with a quarter of a million bucks, I bet. Yes, that's true. Yeah. So uh, uh, the schools in Johnston, uh, terrific school system. You got the recreation around you. If we have viewers who aren't familiar with our metro, uh, that new high school is state of the art. Yeah, state of the art high school. I think we've got 40 miles of tra bike trails in right. Johnston now. Just yep. a lot to do there. Great access to I-80 and uh, shopping and convenience. Have we teased them long enough? Shall we have well, a look? I think we should show it. Yeah. <laughs> Let's take a look and tell me all about it. Well, we've got a story and a half sitting in Augustine on uh, two thirds of an acre. So you can see it's got a huge kitchen in it, all custom cabinets, um, custom appliances, granite tops, bamboo floors, um, huge, huge deck off the back, and part of it's covered, part of it's open. Mm -hmm. Just a very, very nice house. So you can see the Viking stove top there. There's the sun porch. Beautiful, beautiful. Nuts and bolts here, five bedrooms, five bath areas. You mentioned the huge uh, three-car garage, really with a thousand square feet out there. That's amazing. Right. There's over 5,600 foot of finish in this house. Mm -hmm. And uh, again, it was custom. There's the office. That's a great shot. Beautiful. Master. And each bedroom with its own bath arrangement. Correct. Each bedroom has a bath. Nice. And when we get to the lower level, you're going to be knocked out by this uh, bar area. It's kind of like an Irish pub. Yeah. If you just joined us, this is Augustine and Johnston, a great Iowa home. And let's let's uh, throw the price out there because I think people are going to be expecting it to be more rich. Uh, it's 675. 675. <clears throat> and as is so often the case with a great Iowa home, just try to replace it for that when the home site itself is going to cost so Correct. much nowadays. Yeah. It it have to be pushing close to a million dollars if you could even do it for that. Absolutely. Absolutely. So uh, 675 Great Iowa Home. Uh, if you're not a cash buyer, how could the rates be any better? Oh. Even jumbos are under 4%. I know. It is absolutely the best time ever to be a luxury buyer. And uh, this wonderful story and a half can be seen by giving Rick Brattrude a call. Um, which office, Rick? I'm out of Valley West. Valley West office. But I actually live in Johnston, so I'm only a couple blocks from the house. Oh, perfect. That is absolutely perfect. Well, we'll um, hope the phone rings and then get a private personal tour. I will do that. Good to see you. You bet. Thank you. Great Iowa Homes, by the way, can be seen every Sunday in the Des Moines uh, Sunday Register and online at iowarealty.com. And virtually every single Great Iowa Home is a bona fide bargain, as is this one in Johnson and Augustine. Coming up, Savannah Homes in Altoona with 
a recent winner of the uh, Better Business Bureau's Integrity Award. Stay with us. Ready for that big move? Work with the company that knows the most about residential real estate in the state of Iowa. Ted Grobe is here. One of my favorite guests over the years. Do I say that too often? You no, think but thank you. <laughs> it's good to have you back. It's good to be here. You know, we when we go to Altoona, uh, the west side has, has been maybe where the major growth in our metro has been. Mm -hmm. But we can't forget about Altoona because things are cooking in Altoona. Uh, tax abatement, great schools, Southeast Polk School System. Mm -hmm. You got Adventureland and Prairie Meadows, one of these days soon again for entertainment, the Outlet Mall. You got the best trails perhaps in the metro. The bypass. I mean, there are a lot of really good things to say about Altoona. Yeah, you're, you're kind of doing my job here, Mike. Well, but yeah, you you pretty much hit on just about all of it, and not only that, but if you look at the cost of new construction right. and what we deem to be entry level construction or work uh, work workforce housing in the metro, uh, everywhere out west is. I mean, if you can find 280 and under, you're lucky. Exactly. But it's mostly 280 and, and above 300, whereas the houses we're looking at today are, are sub 242. Yeah, so. uh, absolutely. Price a big factor. And Savannah Holmes, uh, that's your father. Mm -hmm. I know you're, you're modest, you don't like to brag, but he won the Better Business, uh, Better Business Bureau Integrity Award. He's been at this for half a century. He knows how to do it. He's got a formula for quality with affordability. And uh, I'll shut up and you can talk about this house. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate the plug about my dad. It's an honor to work for him. It oh, really I can is. Uh, we have a lot of fun together and he's, uh, he's pretty good at what he does. So uh, the house that we're looking at today is 715 18th Street Southeast in Altoona. Um, it's called the Poplar Floor Plan. Um, nice open floor plan, three bedroom, two bath. Um, you got stainless steel appliances in the uh, in the kitchen, and one of the biggest features in the house is a covered patio, which is really nice. Country Cove Park, name mm -hmm. of the neighborhood. Uh, in addition to this home, which is priced at two forty one nine, you heard me right. Um, a couple of others uh, under construction, ranches in the same neighborhood price wise, and then five home sites. So. Some good opportunities here, depending on your timetable. That's correct. Yeah, we got five new lots out there, and uh, we're excited about those. So we've got uh, we've got some homes under roof, and uh, we've got some fresh dirt if somebody wants to start from scratch. Let's mention West Des Moines because this is big news coming yeah, it's coming kind of, soon. It's fun, and, and we're looking forward to it. And uh, we're we're going to be rolling it out here pretty quickly. But we've got five lots and five homes uh, under construction in West Des Moines. All five are going to be sub two sixty. Unbelievable! Yeah. That is amazing. Great builder, Savannah Homes, Ted Grobe. Uh, at our Jordan Grove office, waiting for the phone call to show you around the neighborhood and look at several homes if you like and talk about a home site or whatever works for you. Ted, good to see you. Good to see you Tell as well. Tell Dad hello. I will. Midland Title and Escrow, Iowa's largest independent settlement company. Uh, down the hall in the building uh, on the Iowa Realty team. Coming up, another hot spot in the metro. That's Norwalk. Stay with us. Feel the difference the moment you step in the door. The ambiance, authentic, eclectic, compelling. We love the mix. Timeless designs from formal to funky. At The Elements, we want your space to feel like you. Our design team can help you choose a fabric, find the perfect sofa, or transform your entire home. Ask about our risk-free house call service. Visit elementsbykcsorby.com in Storm Lake and in the District of Prairie Trail in Ankeny. We're anything but ordinary. Well, I have a soft spot for Norwalk. Grew up there, went to high school there, and good grief. The changes are absolutely incredible. I think last week we did some kind of a metaphor of the light bulb glowing really brightly in Norwalk these days, and it certainly is. Kate Schaefer is here. Nice to see you. Nice to see you, Mike. She's with Iowa Really, of course, and Nick Scar is with us. Nick. Good morning, Mike. Good to see you. Let's sing the praises of Norwalk, Iowa, shall we? Yes. Uh, Norwalk is obviously up and going community has already been growing a lot. Uh, state basketball champions, plenty of new right. restaurants coming in. Um, Starbucks is coming in. Hy-Vee starting some stuff down there. Uh, grant, brand new sub developments coming in down there as well. Uh, good school system, some plenty of recreation. commercial development as well and manufacturing. Yeah, yep. it's absolutely growing. Leaps and bounds, tax abatement on new construction in Norwalk and that uh, new high school and football uh, stadium and the new performance center, state of the art. So great place to live. And the commute is unbelievable. And Kate, uh, our builder is doing great things at Orchard Hills. 
correct Mike, Kirk Mickelson's been building homes in the metro for 16 years now. Every Tanzanite and KRM home is built with a Zip Systems exterior sheathing as well as uh, advanced tech flooring, which has a 10 year squeak free guarantee. So he's doing a lot of things different in the homes. And uh, basically to differentiate between the two companies, Nick, uh, Tanzanite more of a marketing uh, home and KRM a little more on the custom side, normally speaking. Correct, we actually have four series of homes, a streamline, which is an upfront selections process. Um, then we have our silver series, which that floor plan cannot be modified. It would be one of our stock plans, but you can pick out everything. Yep. Our select series is custom Tanzanite. You can move anything with that. And then our higher end homes, fancier trim, that type of stuff, more true custom, bring us a blueprint, would be that KRM development phase. So now we have three homes at Orchard Hills in Norwalk, uh, two of them ready to go, right? Yep, uh, the one that we're looking at now is a four bedroom, three bath, walkout farmhouse amber plan. Has that farm sink on the front of it. I got an exterior board and bat elevation. Nice walkout with some trees in the backyard. Um, has that zip system, the quartz countertops, LVP flooring, um, tile shower in it. Uh, the nice brick fireplace look. This one's at 338. Okay. And then we have a similar floor plan to that with the flat ceilings, a little bit more contemporary flair on the outside, right up the street. Uh, that one will be 318. And that is not a walkout, that's a daylight Yep, window. that one is a flat lot or okay. a standard lot. Okay. And then uh, we have a bigger home in Blooming Heights, which is between Cumming and Norwalk. It's on a half acre lot. That one's 495, about 1,800 square feet plus the basement finish walkout. Well, people need to know if they're shopping for a building Builder and a community. I mean, uh, you can't go wrong <laughs> either way here with Norwalk or Tanzanite and KRM. Uh, they've, they're a growing company over the last five or six years, tremendous growth around the metro. They do a lot of custom building, more on the KRM side, if I'm right. Mm -hmm. Yep, so with that, um, I mean, if you've got a lot that you've owned for a while and hadn't decided what to want to do or build, we would love that opportunity as well. We're in about 40 communities throughout the metro right Just now. Just amazing. Help with closing costs? Yes, home services lending will do no closing costs, no origination. Good stuff. You can stop and see both Nick and Kate this afternoon from 1 to 4, Orchard Hills and Norwalk. Norwalk's on the come. Good to see you both. Good to Thanks, see you, Mike. Mike. This is the Iowa Realty Weekly. You'll find it every uh, Sunday in the Sunday Register right behind the main news section. Great Iowa homes, hot new listings, builder ads, and much more. And coming up, Jen Schuler will be here to talk about a female competing and excelling in a men's arena building homes in Ankeny. Visit iowarealty.com and have instant access to 23,000 available listings. Iowa Realty is number one in Iowa. Jen Schuler is here. Uh, she's one of our top performers with the Iowa Realty Company. Good to have you back. Thank you. And we usually talk about Ankeny and our friend Liz Chesney uh, with Kyanite Design and Build. And you know, uh, I saw a t-shirt the other day that says the future is female. <laughs> and it just made me think about her uh, being a woman in a men's arena. And she, she doesn't just uh, compete, she excels. She really does. She's a great builder. She's a wonderful builder and I'm so excited to work with her. Well, we're going to the crossings of Deer Creek in uh, uh, Ankeny, one of the fastest growing cities in America, if you're not familiar. And this is east of I-35, am I right? Correct. Okay. Well, tell me about uh, this ranch that we're gonna see because it's pretty special. This ranch is really special. You know, it has five bedrooms, three baths, walk out lower level, but what really makes it special is the home site itself. Um, it has an out lot next to it, so you have that extra space, and then it backs to trees and a pond. So some really neat features on this. You know, you're right in the heart of things, uh, minutes from everything in Ankeny and a great commute uh, spot to go to Ames or Des Moines or any direction really uh, that you want to, but it feels like you're kind of out in the country. It does, and then when you see wildlife, when I'm at open house and I see wildlife, see people fishing in the pond, yeah. it just gives that privacy and something that you just don't see very often. And that outlaw just feels like it's yours, so it makes it look like you have a huge yard. Yes. Yeah. Well, tell me the nuts and bolts here and let's take a closer look. Yeah, so just under 1,700 square feet in this home on the main level. And then you've got the two by six construction, GE slate appliances. And then I love sort of this coastal boho feel of this home. Nice. So, and the lights are amazing. And when people walk in and see the large windows, they're just immediately impressed. Well, and you know, we need to mention that uh, Liz has three girls. 
teenage girls, I think all of them are, and she knows how families live, and as, as, we, as she likes to say, she knows where they're going to throw their, their book bags and all the rest of it, so those female touches work. They really do. So in the bathroom on the main level, so there's a door in between where the tub shower yeah. is and where the sinks are. So just if they're, you know, kids are getting ready in the morning, just that extra privacy. Exactly. And in this uh, five bedroom, two story, uh, you're going to see Pella and Delta and really great brand names everywhere. Correct. Yeah. And that two by six construction. And I think we're going to see the covered deck here in just a moment. If you just flipped on the tube, we're at the crossings of Deer Creek, east of I-35, and then a little north, uh, Ankeny Address. And, you know, if we have new viewers, boy, what can you say about Ankeny? The great schools? Great schools, you know, um, we talked about it before, quick commute, whether it's Des Moines, right. Ames. So it's just a growing community and a really family-friendly neighborhood. And you have uh, new retail popping up. You have the lakes and the parks and golf all around you. Uh, just a wonderful uh, place to live. And of course, that's why it's one of the fastest growing cities in America. Uh, now, you'll be there this afternoon from 1 to 3. Correct. For the tour. And let's talk about safety precautions in this extraordinary time we're living in. Uh, you're going to take care of all that so that folks can come and feel safe when they yes. get there. We have hand sanitizer, booties at each homes. Uh, in between uh, guests, I like to wipe down uh, the door handles, things like that. Yeah. So anything to make people feel safe. Good stuff. One to three open house with uh, Jen Schuler this afternoon. And I uh, want to remind you that closing costs are taken care of by the preferred lender. Thanks again. Thank Appreciate you. it. Iowa Title serving Polk, Dallas, Warren, Scott, and Lynn counties. Part of the Iowa Realty team, and that is our show. Put us on your calendar 10 a.m. every Sunday here on Local 5 in our 37th year. Mike Pace, till next time, have a great week. Feel the difference the moment you step in the door. The ambiance, authentic, eclectic, compelling. We love the mix. Timeless designs from formal to funky. At The Elements, we want your space to feel like you. Our design team can help you choose a fabric, find the perfect sofa, or transform your entire home. Ask about our risk-free house call service. And don't be shy about your ideas. We'll help you bring them to life. Decorating for your loft or any space today offers you more freedom than ever before. At The Elements, our design team can help you inject just the right amount of attitude to give your space that personal, it's you feeling. Visit our Loft Living showroom and break out your fun, funky ideas. Maybe all you need are some cool throw pillows and a great piece of art. Ask about our risk-free house call service and visit elementsbykaysorby.com in Storm Lake and in the District at Prairie Trail in Ankeny. The Elements, we're anything but ordinary.